Hey guys, it's Brad here from churchwp.net. Hey, I'm going to teach you today how you can edit photo sizes right in WordPress. You may be intimidated by a theme like this, which is the resurrect theme by churchthemes.com because how of all the images it uses and to get the images to the right size can be kind of intimidating. Well, you guess what? You don't have to buy any new fancy software, Adobe or use GIMP or learn anything like that. You can do all of this right built into WordPress and it's a lot easier than what you think. So the first thing you need to do is kind of just figure out what size image you need. Some themes like this one actually tell you what the sizes are where you import them. Others don't. And so one of the easiest ways to get it is to just actually um, look at the images they use on their demo site and open up that image and uh, to see the size of it. Uh, but this one here actually has, you can also Google it, uh, but this one here actually has it built right into every spot that you put it in. It's kind of cool. So here is the homepage highlights, the section that I was looking at. And you can see here's the image that was on that screen. And you see right here, it says image crop to 600 by 410. Well, the reality is that this image isn't. So that's what we're going to show you how to do today. In order to do this, in order to edit the photos, you need to click on the media part here of the dashboard. Click on the photo that you want to edit. I want to edit this get plugged in image right here. And so I'll click on that edit button. You still got one more step. You can't start editing right away. Click scroll down here and click on the edit image button and this will bring this up and all of these things up here are the tools that you can use now the first thing that we you may want to do is to scale down the image to make it a little bit smaller so uh, that you can make it fit everything you want in it I want my image to be 600 by 410 if you remember so I'm gonna actually make it 425 is what the height I want and uh, make it that way and now I'm gonna crop it so it's 600 by 400 exactly now this kind of tricked me up for a little bit but it's actually simpler than what you think because every time I try and click on this crop button and nothing would come up what you need to do is click your mouse button on the screen and keep it down and kind of drag it to make a box now the cool thing about it is over here it shows you exactly how big that box is now you can move it to it comes to the exact spot that you want I can move it like this or you can do what I like to do which is just enter the value there that you need. We needed it 600 by 410 and it will create the exact size box. Box. Then what you do is you put your mouse over there uh, and you'll see that it turned into uh, those four little arrows. Well, that means that you can drag it and move it and do anything like that that you want. Now, I want the get plugged in like this. So I'm going to actually uh, go just like this and move it to where it's there. But you know what? I look at this and go, huh, this isn't exactly the way that I want it to. So I'm actually going to make it a little bit smaller and scale it again and do four let's try 415 as my image size to scale it i'm gonna have to repeat the process again but it's no big deal and i just want to get a little bit more of that image so here we go again we highlight the section just like i did come over here 600 by 410 all right by 410 make sure you enter those values right get more of that kind of zap right there okay i like what i look and I hit save. Hit the crop button up here and then hit save. And there you go. There is your updated image. Now I'm going to click uh, updated right here and I'll do that. And that's perfect. And now what I'll do is to come over here to my widget and get it to look exactly the way that I want it to make sure that it's updated there. You'll see that it even updated there automatically because I did that. So uh, that is exactly how you edit and crop and scale an image in WordPress. Hey, we got a ton of different other tutorials that you may want to check out, some design tips for your church site or other sites and more at churchwp.net. So come check us out. Thanks.